guys! Welcome to W and L Review. Today we are reviewing the TV show CSI. It, <coughs> it, it's from 2000 to 2015, and it is directed by Anthony E. Zucker. Zucker, I think. Anyway, it stars William Peterson, Marg Helgenberger, Gary Durdon, George Eads and Georgia Fox. And with that, I will let my daughter tell you about the show. So, of course, CSI follows this group of CSIs, crime scene investigators. And, um, it's a really good show. If you guys haven't watched it and you're into crime shows, you should go watch this. Um, it, it has a, a thread of romance through with some of the characters, but not all. And it's just enough to be like it's something to where there's more of ca more character interaction than just um, people who work together, but it doesn't completely take away from the show's premise either. It doesn't distract from it too much. It does prove to have some cause some interesting situations, we'll just say, but it doesn't take over the entire show. I know I enjoyed it. I would say that you probably shouldn't let kids younger than 13 watch it because there are, it's of course a show about death and also it's, it's located in Vegas so there's often scenes in certain places that you might not want your kids to be exposed to but um, have them see anything from. But with that being said, I know I really like the show for its crime aspects, and with that I'll let my mom tell you her opinion of it. Okay. Uh, it is a really good show. Um, the first few shows probably were kind of, uh, eh, eh. and once, you know, they kind of, I guess, got m more watchers, which then meant, meant more money, maybe, I guess, I don't know. They got a little bit better with their storyline, and the acting was better, and all that. Um, William Peterson plays Gil Grissom, and he is, like, the head of the CSI unit. And CSI is crime scene investigators, and he is more of, like, a... Like, he looks more in-depth in into things, and he's a... Um, insect guy. He's like, um, yeah. And then there's, um, Catherine, who's played by Mark Helgenberger, and, um, she's kind of like, um, uh, well, let's just say her, you know, some of the, some of the stuff in the show was kind of like unbelievable. She was supposed to be like this ex stripper, and now she's like this brilliant person who works at CSI. I suppose that can happen. Not not making a judgment. I just kind of, you know, kind of she, it starts out kind of like, duh. And then she's all of a sudden this brainiac. And so I'm kind of like, I don't understand. Um, uh, her and um, Warwick, who is played by Gary Durdon, um, have this kind of sexual tension between the two of them off and on through a few of the seasons, uh, and different episodes, you know, like, uh, so it's not like a, like this ongoing perpetual, like, okay, thing, but it's like, um, yeah. Um, and I see his name, and I can't think of his character's name. Don't Him. know. I don't know. Um, Nikki, or Nick. Coates is played by George Eads. Um, he he's, uh, he's my favorite. <laughs> he's my least favorite. Nikki? Mm -hmm. Well, fine. I think Nikki's very cute. And I wouldn't mind if he came to my door and said hello, but you know, <laughs> that's gonna happen. Anyway, um, he kind of, he's like, um, kind of an a cowboy who comes to Vegas. I mean, he's just kind of like, 
a fish out of water. He just, you know, and he kind of doesn't know a lot of the things that happen, you know, and he kind of get, gets, um, gets, gets lessened, lessened, gets taught in a, in a, uh, in a abruptly, not an easy way. Um, Sarah Seidel is played by Georgia Fox. I had a, I had a, a blink there for a second. Um, and her and Gil Grissom have this on and off thing and there's this flirtation and it, oh, does it not going to happen? Oh, maybe it will. Maybe it won't. And then, and then, you know, basically she comes to CSI because Gil had asked her to come to CSI. And then, um, you know, like I said, there's this on again, off again flirtation. And then there's this jealousy because she, he's, he starts to show attention to some, some others. And, you know, he's like, you know, not that big a deal. Well, then she basically says, hey, you know, and then. They end up getting married. It's kind of a way that they did it. It was kind of neat. Um, he leaves the show. And then she ends up leaving the show. And when they, But they show them on the show, off the show. <laughs> like, they're, they're somewhere else, like in Africa or whatever, supposedly. And, you know... She basically said, I, you know, I, w I want to be with you. And so they end up getting married and, and it's, it's very sweet. Um, the show is long time, long running show. I mean, 15 years, 16 years, you know, uh, so, you know, you got a lot of stuff that happens. There's, um, there's Greg. They they don't have, and I don't have his name here. But the guy who plays Greg, who is in <laughs> this, he starts out in the lab in, in, in CSI. And he's just this overly gooberish guy. He's just silly, and he likes to listen to music really loud. And um, then eventually he ends up going out in the field. And so his character goes through this metamorphosis like crazy but he's one of my favorites too he's super funny and to watch him like the early days to watch him in the later days it's like whoa what a change um and then david hodges plays another character there's others that played in the show too that i don't know their name uh right off hand but like i said this is a long was a long running show and it was a really good show and um um it to me was one that um i i did watch with my teenage son and i did watch with um my daughter uh later on not when she was little um but um I would say, um, I can't remember what channel it's on. I think it is on Hulu. Hulu, yeah. So, but you might be able to find it someplace else. Sometimes they do that. Um, um, if you happen to find it, give it a chance. Give it a shot. I would say the first few episodes are kind of, <laughs> they're not very good. Um, and they're kind of, meh. Uh, but if you can... If you can muster the courage to go, I don't know, I would say at least five or six episodes in. And if you still think it's a poo fest, then don't watch it anymore. But it it was, it started to get better. I mean, it, it you know, the first season is kind of meh, meh, meh. But you kind of have to watch the first season to kind of know more about the characters, where they come from, and all this other gobbledygook. But, um, anyways, guys, with that, I will say thank you to all our subscribers. And thank you to Nate and Marion, also known as That Nate Guy on YouTube and Life Unbox. 
um, for being our friends and for supporting our channel and um, as well as everybody else who has supported our channel. Um, thank you very, very much. Um, and if you want to join our Patreon, the link will be in the description below. And um, I can't think of anything else, can you? No? And with that, guys, we will say we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.